Only on CBS Atlanta. You have got to see this story before you hit your mattress tonight. Dirty, disgusting, just plain gross. It's the only way we can describe what we found inside mattresses being sold as new in stores in Metro Atlanta. Perspiration, urine, feces, blood, dust mites, dust skin cells. And that's only the beginning. Tonight, investigative reporter Jeff Cherico is asking tough questions about what could be in your mattress. I started investigating a Metro Atlanta mattress company three months ago after I received a tip from a viewer. We were horrified by what we found. We were told the pristine looking mattresses were new, but that's not what our undercover investigation revealed. Filth, mold, urine, blood, do you see that? That's what we found inside the mattresses that you make here. The pictures I showed these guys... Ew! It was shock. It was almost sickening. ...show something no one expected us to find. Our investigation begins as our undercover team visits Mattress for Sale in Forest Park. Listen to what the saleswoman tells our producer. They're new, yes ma'am. Did she say new? They're new, yes ma'am. They're brand new? We manufacture them ourselves. Oh, you do? Yes, ma'am. We buy two mattresses and take them to Champion Cleaning Systems in Coweta County. Slide it up on the table. To let certified master cleaner Jeremy Reitz slice them open. Look at here. This is actually not what I expected to find in here. Look, look there. Oh, jeez. Under the new white cover, we find used, stained mattress parts with perspiration, urine, feces, blood, dust mites, dust skin cells. We find water damage and mold. If I saw that on the street, I wouldn't touch it, much less would I sleep on it. We can't help but wonder how many people are sleeping on a mattress they skin thought was new, but isn't. There's potentially uh, very um, unhealthy bacteria in these these mattresses I think it's incredibly um, unscrupulous to sell something like that my name is Jeff I'm with uh, CBS Atlanta News so we take our tough to question to the woman who sold us the beds who happens to be the store manager what do you tell people when they come in here and ask if they are new or if they're used I tell them they're new because that's the best of my knowledge and I don't, you know, I'm not going to say that they're refurbished if I don't know that they are. We're not sure how she didn't know they were used. Look at this mattress right here. When we stop at the factory, it's clear the place collects piles of disgusting mattresses for some reason, and we want to know what it is. Are you taking used material and reusing them? Yes, sir. I want to talk to the owner about this. But that's a lie. As they lock the gate and walk away, our camera catches the owner, Kamal Shelbaya, hiding from us. Come on, my name is for long, he's about to be called to the state capitol by an angry lawmaker. I am embarrassed to have this in my district. And we were at that meeting to ask the company owner the tough questions, and the lawmaker now has his own tough questions after we tell him there aren't any state laws regulating this industry. That's coming up.